Hello! If you're watching this right as I'm launching the video, I am getting ready for a sale over on Yvonne's channel, Yvonne Thrifty Rich. Me, Yvonne, and Becky will be there. I will link it here as well as below. Come join us! Hey everyone, it's Amy, owner and curator of Yo So Boho. I'm here with my sister, Cindy. <laughs> she was with me, it's been 11 months. You need to do this more. We said that you needed to do this more the last time we did this, 11 months 11 ago. 11 months ago. Mm -hmm. And you never came back. Well, I'm here now. She's here now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy about that. We went two days in a row because we're both recovering from COVID. <laughs> so we have zero <laughs> strength or stamina. We did pretty good though. We did. In the bins, we were there for three hours. Three long we, hours. We went through all of the bins. She was going through her haul and I'm like, you gotta hurry up because I'm still buying stuff. Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> well, I was going through everything, deciding what was gonna stay and go. And I narrowed down a lot of stuff, mm -hmm. a lot of stuff. So you're gonna see some shopping. But a lot of the things I pick up, you know, of course, I'll share a value with you. But I sat and I looked everything up and I put half of it all back. So um, so we're going to show you what we did find. And of course, we're going to take you shopping. So let's start there. We're at the Akron Goodwill Outlet, which is also known as The Bins. So let's do some shopping. <laughs> you know I do that. Let's go shopping. <laughs> Tabletop three. <laughs> hey! <laughs> The Goodwill location here in Akron is at 507 East Waterloo Road. It has an outlet side, which we call the bins, as well as a retail side, which we actually visit the following day. So I will have that shop along um, for you on Thursday. And we had a great time here on this day. Started right up front here with some art. And then let me just get in here and share with you um, some of the audio. We didn't have a lot of music on this side, so it's kind of fun to hear our back and forth and what we find. Let's check it out. <sighs> Avon. All these little things with removable heads. What is this? Ducks. Why do they uh, have removable one. heads? I don't know, that one has a chipped beak. <laughs> I don't know, but here's some heads. Just some heads. Weird. Probably going to see a ton of Christmas stuff because everybody donated their... Yeah. They're like, oh, got new stuff. He's kind of cool. Huh? Bunch of Santos all the way. Is he smoking there. a pipe too? Wow. That's weird. It sold at Marks, but it's a Gans piece. It's kind of heavy though. A chia thing. Oh, oh, where did he go to? Look at, he's the top of something. <laughs> See, that's cute. I have a cork that would go in that yeah. for okay. catnip. It needs cleaned. It's got a little. Is that a cat or a mouse sticking out there? It's a cat. All it's right. Catnip. It's catnip, I guess it's cat. But it is a signed pottery piece, Francis 95. But I'm gonna put a cork in it and I'll make it I wish cuter. you would put a cork in it. You're funny. Super funny. Slay so all day. Slay all day. Oh no. Oh no. Somebody did Santa wrong. What's <laughs> <laughs> Santa? So they were. Poor, poor Santa. Oh, those are butterflies. Simple 
Bed Bath & Beyond, it was $40. Look at how cute that is. It's really beat up though. Could just use a fresh coat of black. A little bit of liquid wood. <laughs> Isn't that adorable though? Look at how fun. I decided to leave that one for someone else, but the one right next to it here, I did decide was cool enough to grab. It says down here, Normandy 1944. On the back, what I loved about this is it says, this is the picture that inspired my toy collection. So I don't know what the toy collection was. Maybe it was tanks <laughs> or Jeeps. <laughs> I don't know, but I loved that about this and so I grabbed it. I think at the booth, some guy's gonna come through and absolutely love it. It's well framed and he's just gonna grab it, so. Wow, it's not ugly. It's pretty. It's for a small, small girl. Very small. Here, you wanna need a Girl Scout? Aw, somebody's. Let's go. Quench your thirst. What is that back there? You have long arms? That tree skirt? That? No, it's just a table. Oh. Is this a bed skirt? So it was brand new, 40 bucks. Look at this. Zero dollars. Nice. So is that like the flat sheet and then the fitted? And then this is a fancy over? I don't know. I mean, they're super nice quality. Ooh, I see something crocheted in here. Little, little blanket. Ooh, I love this color and this feel. This is 100% cashmere, Sin. Yeah. I love my cashmere color. I love that color. That's a good old Tallex. Look at that old Kent State sweatshirt. Mm -hmm. It's a good vintage one. Is this one of the old ones? Pretty wrecked. Yeah. Mark down. What is this? Oh, that's cute. Look at that. There was a bunch of things with TJ Maxx tags on them. I think TJ Maxx zeroed them out because the price stickers are zero and donated them. To Goodwill. So this little guy is like a little topiary bunny. And I was hoping there would be more of these because I think he's adorable. There's some that um, on the picture here that like stand up and there's different sizes. So I think he'll be really cute in the spring, which is Assembl a spring assemblage. There oh, you go. He might be really cute in a spring assemblage, but he's modern. He's not vintage. So maybe somebody else's spring assemblage. Okay. <laughs> but I'm going to put him in the booth. I'm going to pepper him in with the rest of our spring stuff, which is right around the corner. Probably going to be going in there within a month or so. And it, so the pages are probably buried in here somewhere. I'm explaining to my sister because when we first walked over here, I found the cover of a very, very old songbook. And so I'm just here explaining to her what it was and why I was trying to find like the inside pages. Now she's seen it by now and she's also looking for the inside pages. And she's saying it's kind of sad that it was pulled apart because it was really, really old. And here it is. Nicole. No, that's the first thing I spotted over here, but. I would tuck you in. Cute. That's adorable. Cute little baby book. I'm building a little library and this is I Would Tuck You In. 
So it's got a bunch of animals with their babies. Very cute. It's got a little ding up here, but it's in pretty good shape. Little big foot. Toy Story, Pixie Chicks. What is that? Is that it? That's it. That's it. Pretty much all kind of in one piece. I don't know what how you would. I know. That's oh. it. Have you got any illustrations or anything in it, or is it just all music? It's just all music. I don't know what I would do with that. Put it on top so somebody might see it. What's the year on it? Copyright 1909. 1909. Wow. 1912. 1912. Good year. I remember it well. <laughs> Let's see. Opus. Bloom County member. <laughs> she just grabbed it. <laughs> she literally just grabbed it right off. You set it right here and she. Gooseberry patch. Still in the packaging. <laughs> That's cute. Why is the pants down? Smarty pants. Cute. Free K genius. Ten tiny monkeys. It says collect all ten, which was so weird. Sydney noticed that two of them are repeats. And we're missing this guy right here. <laughs> so if anybody has this guy right here, I'll have all ten. <laughs> But they are adorable. They're miniature. Not sure yet if I'm gonna put them in my miniature collection. I kind of like that they're still in the box. I did not see, oh, 2012. So they're not real old, but they're 10 years. 10 years, 10 years old, but pretty adorable. <laughs> what did you find? Potato. What is it? I don't know. <laughs> it's got a cute body. Where's the face? Fragile. Ooh, what's in here? These are really generic. Hey. hey. The head? Is that the head? It's wonky enough that it could possibly be a head. <laughs> it's got <laughs> it's, it's got lights on it. I bet it's the head. It's like this tiny little pin. I got a cabbage patch head. How creepy is that? That's kind of cool. Make your own cabbage patch? That's old. Yeah, it is. We might want to look that up. The original doll baby. Like Remember? Like who made us? 86. 86. We should look that up. Who was it that made us our own cabbage patch? I don't know. <laughs> what did you find? Those are old. That one's got a damaged spot. Made in Taiwan. Maybe they're not old. Yeah, Taiwan would be oh. older. Those are cool. So like a decoupage kind of. They weigh nothing. I know. A lot of these balls were in the, in a bag together and then there was a ton of them just scattered all throughout this bin 
and Cindy went through it first and kept pulling them out. And then I got in there later, came back and found a bunch more. Mm -hmm. But here's the biggest of them. And it's just like the decoupage like scenery where it's all split and then joined together around probably a styrofoam. They're a little older. They have a nice vintage look. Some of them are super cute. They definitely use like a vintage pictures to create these. And then there's small ones. So whole giant bag of them. And then these cute little wooden girls on swings. I think there's a red one and a green one in here. Two red ones and a green one. Two red ones and a green one. She's so cute. <laughs> but yeah, these will all go over to the shop later this year. These will go over to the shop. Tiny little uh, slinky, slinky. I don't know. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah. Add it to the bag. Something in here clinking around. Oh. He almost looks like he could be a Fitz employed. He is a Fitz employed. That's not his box. He's in a Lennox box, but that's a Fitz and Floyd. Can you please put him in the cart? Is he broke? Wait, he's broken. He's broken. Is he? Yep, right here. Oh, Never mind. Yeah. He's Darn it. Broken. I really like these because it's easy to tell which is the salt and which is the pepper. Right. Quick, right? Right. But this, this is definitely the salt. Oh, Lord. <laughs> She's terrible. But what I also like about these is they were cheap because they were in the bins. They were 49 cents because they were kitchen ceramic. Probably cost me 20 cents. <laughs> and these will go over to the booth because... I have sold a ton of salt and pepper shakers at the booth. So, Weird. in the whimsical booth. Who would have thunk it? Who would have thunk it? So, I've been looking for some to replace. And 20 cents to probably mm. six or eight bucks for these. It's a nice little profit. Yeah, no, that's scary. Oh, what is this? That's cute. Love the colors on this. Absolutely stunning. It's a little pitcher, but the handle has been repaired. This, this piece right here was broken and it has glue in it. But as I picked it up and Cindy and I both oohed and odd over the color, mm -hmm. she said, yeah, but you can display it. And she's right. I probably wouldn't use it, but on the shelf, you can't it'll tell. go. Yeah, it'll go really nicely with the rest of my collection, and it is beautiful. Love him so much. He is a scotch mm -hmm. made, so scotch tape. And they made a black one and a white one. They made a whole bunch of cute stuff. We were looking them up when we were kind of looking through the bag at what we got. And they 
sell for what, 25 bucks? Something like that. 25 bucks. <laughs> so again, he weighs really not much. Um, and he will be going on eBay for whatever the going rate is. I will share a comp here, but keep an eye out for cute little critters made by Scotch Tape. Brand new in the box, meow, <laughs> meow. Well, let's open it, meow, and see what's in there. <laughs> right, meow. Right, meow. <laughs> <laughs> open it, right, meow. Coasters. That spell meow. I don't have to get them all out, but they're all the different. W or the M? That's the W. If it was this way, the cat would be upside down. Good eye. Yeah. Linda Spivey, licensed by Penny Lane Publishing. So, awesome. Love to find new in the box stuff. And again, I don't know if I'm gonna put these on eBay or if they will go over to the Whimsical booth. Who are you? <laughs> Look at this guy. Here, put him in the cart. It's like playing a, playing a banjo. Ribbit. <laughs> he is so funny looking. He almost looks like he could be Shawnee Pottery, um, just in his glaze. It's kind of got that airbrush kind of glaze. He's in really great condition. He's heavy, very quality, and totally adorable. Who needs a frog playing a banjo? Everybody. Every, everybody, right? Everybody. Yeah. With a face like that, he's singing a song. He's definitely singing too. But he'll probably, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna look him up. Of course, I'll give you a value here if I find what he is, who made him, blah, blah, blah. He's Jeremiah. He's Bullfrog. And he's singing. Was he a good friend of yours? He was. He was a good friend of mine too. He had good wine. Oh yeah. Yes. Mighty fine wine. Mighty fine wine. <laughs> Wedding candles. Those are old. Flora. These are all like at a weird wow. angle. Huh? Mary and Joseph Fuss. Yeah, they're hauling molds, which are nice, but they're not painted very well. <coughs> that sucks. What's that pretty little dish with the red? That's hand painted. Pier one. Weighs nothing. Really? Yeah. Glass? Yeah. Pier one, really pretty little candy lidded jar. Looks like a little kind of apothecary um, jar with that little knobby there. I am going to soak it just to make sure that none of this tape pulls off any of this paint because this paint is raised on the outside. So I think it'll be good at the booth or on eBay later this year. How to beads? Yeah. She might be worth cleaning. Yeah, that is so gross. Cause look at the inside. You can see what those beads are supposed to look like. Look uh -huh. at like. I named her Dusty Rose. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it was disgusting. <laughs> she was so nasty and covered in dust. She still could use some work. But what I did was I took a scrub brush really quick and soapy water and just scrubbed her down. Um, her little pipe cleaner here is still wet and I don't think it's going to be white. <laughs> I think maybe I need a new white pipe cleaner to freshen her up and I think she just needs her hair pulled back but she's pretty cute. They do not have a lot of value. I'm going to say probably six to eight dollars. They're just not there yet but Yvonne, Thrifty Rich, she's been putting away some little beaded and these are safety pins in here. And so this might just have to go in Yvonne's box with the things that I've been collecting for her. And 
I'm sure that, you know, in three years, these are going to blow up and then she'll be worth like $30. <laughs> That's my prediction because Yvonne knows she has a, some insight. A broomy thing? A broomy thing? No, but those picks are kind of good. Are those old? I gave you one of these earlier. I don't know if you kept it in there or not. Probably. Oops, sorry. Sorry, I just stabbed you twice. Now I need a cutting stick. Huh? Now there's six of them. This one's still brand new in the package. It needs a... She ended up finding about eight of these beautiful white rose balls. And there is an upcoming wedding in our family that these may be great for. Yeah. That's a good cash box, actually. And it's got its keys? Yep. It looks like it's really new and it has the keys in it. So it is lockable. It's just a nice little cash box. Now I looked and on Amazon you can get this model this size for 20 bucks. So it's not a huge deal, but it's probably two or three pounds. So two or three bucks, you know, maybe a little over three bucks. And that's not bad for $20. All right. The process of going through. <laughs> no, this is helpful. When we sit and go through everything, we buy nice reusable bags here brought out a bunch of them so we'll carry all the stuff home that we're gonna buy in these bags so I have a couple of things to look up I think it looks better on camera that is so fun right as we were finishing up going through stuff Cindy pulled out this scarf and I could see it from where she was and I was like oh man hold that up it looks really cool and it is very cool it is an art um, piece it says artwork, it's called The Circus, and the artist is Sophia Brajal, B-R-A-J-A-L, Brajal. And it is huge, and it has, yeah, you can see it on camera. So in each corner, there it's is, down, so yeah, I'm, like, I'm gonna pull it up. Oh, there we go, right yeah, there, right yeah, there. Yeah. So in each corner, there are dogs <laughs> all lined up here on a bicycle. And there's four of them. It's printed on each corner, so it's huge. <laughs> now, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet. I think it would be really cool hanging, maybe in the whimsical booth, um, because it is very whimsical. Um, it won't look like much when you have it on because it just kind of all you know, so I don't know yet what I'm going to do with it, but it's one of those things that it was artsy and whimsical and cool. And I said, I want that. <laughs> <laughs> what did you get? I got some baby stuff. I got baby fever. Oh, yeah. I had grandma baby fever. She's going to be a grandma in baby April. Stuff. In April. In April. <laughs> so, yeah, she was able to find these are awesome. You know that a baby did not wear this when it's white <laughs> and it looks like that. <laughs> if they did wear it, they wore it once. Oh. A little sweatshirt. Oh yeah, that's so cute. It's, little, it's got the little dinosaur. <laughs> so small. This is three months. This is a Carter's piece. Has that got little glasses on it? Yes. <laughs> so nerdy. It's so cute. This is another Carter's. Oh, so cute. This one has spaceships on it. Just a little hooded shirt that has spaceships on it. Also kind of nerdy cute. Very cute. So you got baby clothes. I have some baby clothes. What else did you get? You got clothes for you. Oh, I got tons of clothes for me. Oh, that's right. They're all out in the car, but she went out and got just a few things a to few, show off. Just a few little. And look at this. Brand new with tags. This is this the Carly? Yeah, yes. Okay, so a Carly is like a really long t-shirt. And you were looking for these for... Just for nightgowns. For nightgowns. Yeah. Because they're super comfortable. New with tags. 
Which one is that? Oh, that's a Julia. A uh, Julia. <laughs> oh, this is a dress. Yeah. Brand new with tags. Very cute. Yeah. Which, I, I don't know what this one is. It's very know. long. That one doesn't have tags on it. Three long dresses. This one has pockets. Oh, pockets. I love a dress with pockets. That's what I got. Well, a lot more than that, but that's what you're showing us. Right. She I'll did leave save there. You from the rest of She my did leave there with three bags fashion. of clothing. Well, the one was full of clothing. <laughs> and then you bought some stuff for possibly a wedding. Right. Um, yeah, she got a lot of stuff. And I I mean, you saw what I had. I limited my purchases. Pulled a lot of stuff out, but left a lot of stuff behind, so. I don't have that willpower. All right, everybody, so that was it. That was the trip. That was the haul. We found a lot of great things. Not like a huge, big, like, oh my gosh thing, but a lot of really great things. Saved a lot of money. I spent $17. What did you spend? Like $23. $23. So it's awesome. If you have the opportunity to go to an outlet, I know they're not all the same. Ours is very clean. It's organized. Um, there wasn't a ton of people. There wasn't a ton of people. Mm -mm. It seemed like more people showed up when they knew that the bins were going to be changed out because all of a sudden there seemed to be a lot more people there. Right. But and don't run and they all run to the new bins. <laughs> yeah. Don't run. Don't run. And they all run. I'll go running. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't run. I did go over there. I did check out. We did. Yeah. But it was like, <laughs> let's, we can wait until the, the mad rush, but it was fun. And we spent hours there just going through all mm -hmm. the bins, and that's kind of fun. Although you have to be prepared to be stooped over, um, you know, you're looking down and crawling around in those things. So be prepared, but go check one out. Go rescue some things. There's some amazing things there, and it's super fun. Take a friend or a sister and uh, have a good time. I'm so glad you went with me and you me came too. back it was down. Good time. We'll have to do this again next year. <laughs> In 11 months. In 11 months. I'll see you next February. <laughs> yeah, everybody say, actually, no, you'll see her Thursday because oh, yes. right now we are going to film the thrift haul from the retail, retail side. side. Yeah. So we, we'll actually be back on Thursday with her and maybe we can talk her into coming again in 11 before months. For 11 months. <laughs> All right, everybody. I appreciate you so much. If you're still here with us, Ah, we love you the most. The last time you were here, we did it so that if you were here at this time and you saw us, we gave you a word. Oh yeah. It was shoes it was because shoes. you bought so many shoes. It so this shoes. time it's going to be Jeremiah. Jeremiah. <laughs> if you write Jeremiah, I don't care how you spell it <laughs> below. I will pick someone to receive a fun gift. Something that I pulled out of the bins. I'm going to send to someone. Um, I'm not going to do international. <laughs> I did that last time and it cost some money to ship. So this one we'll do, we'll keep it local. Jeremiah, write it down below and you'll be entered to win something that I pulled out of the bins. It'll be fun. Believe me, it'll be fun. All right. So thank you so much. Put that down below if you're still here. If you're still here and you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. We're trying to grow this little Yoso Boho community. Community? Tribe. Yeah. Tribe. It's a tribe. It's a tribe. I said commun community. -de -de. I don't know. Anyway, we're trying to grow the channel. So the best way to do that too is to share me out. Share me out and tell a friend that uh, they should come over and subscribe. Join our tribe. And what else am I forgetting? Click down below. <laughs> <laughs> Hit a like or a dislike, I don't care. And leave me a comment, tell me what we found that you were um, you know, impressed by, or maybe something that you saw in one of those bins that we missed, because that happens all the time. Anyway, that's all the business. Thank you so much for joining us. We will see you on Thursday. Bye. Bye.